I'm Jake and you're watching Gas Guzzler's coverage of Impa Spring Break 2022. We're going to take a quick overview of this BMW X3 M competition and get it out on the road as part of our Impa test drive coverage. All right guys, let's get into it. Let's take a look at the front of the vehicle. As part of that M competition package, you're gonna get that shadow line package, which is gonna give you blacked out uh, accents throughout the vehicle. You also have BMW LED lighting right here. Let's jump around to the side. Looking at the side of the vehicle, that competition package is gonna get you those 21 inch wheels, which look awesome. You're rocking 255 tires in the front, 265s in the back, pretty wide tires for this SUV. Now, looking at the mirrors, you're also gonna get these special blacked out mirrors as part of that competition package. And you know it's an M car because you have these special M mirrors with the little point on the top. And they are, of course, power folding, you know, heated blind spot, all that good stuff. Um, in terms of the color, this is a 40, $500 Marina Bay blue paint. It is this frozen matte paint and it looks awesome. But it is 4,500 bucks, so it better look awesome. This car comes out to like about $87,000, just a smidge under 90. Um, but you know what? You're getting a lot of vehicle. Let's move to the back. At the rear of the vehicle, you have these awesome tail lights and quad exhaust. That M Competition package does get you a nice fancy sport exhaust. Opening the tail right here can be done with the click of the button. It opens up 28 cubic feet of space roughly with those seats up. Put those down, you'll have about 62 cubic feet of space. Cargo cover is included and it is a 40-20-40 split, meaning you can slide your skis in and still fit four adults in the vehicle. You have a little pull up right here which reveals a spare tire. And then in addition, one thing I wanted to mention was that there are there is a cigarette layer back here but no easy way to put the seats down you have to reach all the way push the shoulder it's small enough it's doable if you're a tall person but some of you may have trouble i did want to mention you can get carbon ceramic brakes on your x3 this one doesn't have it but it is a pretty cool world we live in where you can be getting you know carbon ceramic brakes on your mid-size crossover Let's super quickly talk interior. As part of that M competition package, you do get the M seat belts with this little stitching on them. You do have the merino leather in here. One package out is pretty popular is that executive package. It's $2,450. It's gonna get you a heated steering wheel, heated seats, park assist, a few other goodies. Uh, the materials in here, fantastic. You have some Alcantara accents through the vehicle. You have carbon fiber, leather, stitching. It all comes together just in a really nice way. The interior feels super premium. Only plastic bits you're gonna find in here, down low on your doors where you're never gonna see or touch. They did a really nice job with this interior. Let's talk rear, large glass sunroof right here. You have two USB-C ports here, heated outboard seats as part of that executive package, climate controls for your rear passengers, and of course, air vents back here. You have a pullout in the middle with fancy German cup holders that are always overcomplicated. Point proven, uh, you have the X, um, seat belts back here with that cool red, white, and blue striping. And then in addition, you have plenty of leg room right here. There's plenty of leg room. A uh, pretty big hump in the middle. This vehicle does have all wheel drive. Um, so that's just something to keep in mind, but you could definitely fit four adults in here perfectly comfortably. Let's talk powertrain. This three liter inline six cylinder twin turbocharged engine is pulling out 509 horsepower and 479 pound feet of torque. That's 37 more torque than the last year. So that's new for 2022. That's going to propel this vehicle from 0 to 60 in 3.3 seconds. So that is eye watering fast. Really, really cool engine here. And it sounds mwah, with that M competition exhaust. And now we are underway in the BMW X3 M competition. Just tugged on my seatbelt a little, letting me know I'm ready to go for a sporty drive. But really, all jokes aside, you know, this thing, I've driven some fast cars today. It's ending, you know, it's getting close to the end of Impa Test Day here. And I've driven some quick cars, but this one still surprised me just a little bit. Sorry for the wind noise, folks. It is terribly hot here today. Um, but as I'm driving through here, I got the heads up display, which is really nice. It displays the speed limit, which you're probably ignoring in this car, um, but I will not be because I'm setting a good example. And it shows you know, how fast you're currently going. So you don't have to look down at the digital display down here. This vehicle will probably have the big screen of the iX and the i4. Pretty soon I was just thinking, get rid of this and combine it into one screen. But how about we test that 3.3 second zero to 60 claim, huh, BMW? I don't doubt them, but here we go. I, 
I, I don't doubt him. That's a fast car. And it is fun to do that. It's dangerously fun to just throw your foot down and these cars, 500, three horsepower or something like that in this car. It's insane. Um, and I didn't even press the M button. You have these programmable M buttons on your steering wheel and they do all sorts of different functions. One of them, I, pr I pressed it just to test it out. It said like traction control and everything was gonna be turned off. I was like, uh-uh, I don't know this car well enough to do that. Um, but going through these turns here, you know, you give it power in a turn, it launches you right through. It's confident. You don't feel like you're driving an SUV. The only indication that you're driving an SUV from my perspective right now is that I'm high up. Um, I'm higher up than if I were in a sports car. But other than that, when it comes to driving dynamics, you're paying for a $90,000 crossover, but there's a reason it's $90,000. Um, because this thing is just tuned and is, as BMW says, the ultimate driving machine. You know, pulling through these corners, I'm not ripping it by any means, you know, but I'm going at a fairly decent speed for it turns this tight. And the car just handles them like a dream. It's saying, you know, it's gone. Now, certainly it's not the LC500 I was driving earlier today, but it is just an incredible vehicle. It's weird getting out of an electric car and getting into a gas one and then having no regenerative braking, but I do like the feeling of just coasting. Um, that exhaust, that exhaust is awesome. Having that active sport exhaust, oh, it sounds terrific. Um, you know, just the crackles and pops this car makes, they're terrific. BMW really knows how to make a fun time. Uh, if you're looking for a crossover for the family that's going to make you all giggle and laugh, look right here, folks. This is it. Uh, guys, thank you so much for watching our coverage of Infa Spring Break. I don't know where this video is falling in the lineup, but thank you so much. Be sure to like and subscribe for more weekly automotive content, and we will see you in next week's video.